I'm Corbett Wall with DV Auction. Here with your feeder flash for Monday, October the 16th. And keep those calves a coming. It seems like the heavier the receipts are and the bigger the supplies of calves, uh, the better they sell. And it's a, it's really a, a great fall so far for selling calves. Uh, it's as odd as, as uh, corn going up right during harvest, which doesn't happen very often, but it has happened. But I uh, really don't remember in October that we've ever had where we didn't have uh, supply outweigh demand. And we've got two weeks left, and, and uh, I'm not saying it's gonna happen, but it, I, it's pretty likely that there's usually a week sometime in October where supply outweighs demand of these calves. There's a lot of calves moving, a lot of cattle moving, a lot of previously contracted cattle that were either sold private treaty or on a video auction uh, earlier this summer uh, moving right now. Uh, there's trucks all over the roads. It's hard to get them. Uh, we've got a lot of big sales yet to go here in the next several weeks with a lot of calves moving. But, you know, we've got such good farmer feeder demand. We had another bearish uh, crop report come out late last week. Uh, this corn is, is going to be cheap. It's going to stay cheap. We've got the second largest crop uh, in history out there yet to come in and, and and they've got a really good start on it and rolling right through it on harvest so you know with a lot of that in the bin already guys don't have to worry about that input cost and and uh, you know if you, if you think about it a lot of our input costs are relatively cheap right now so uh, that's that's giving uh, your farmer feeders a, a lot of momentum to get in there and buy cattle and, and there's just a lot of cattle moving and people are buying a lot of them and uh, things are going pretty well right now for, for this fall on, on heavier uh, numbers of cattle on a bigger calf crop and it's, it's not as bad as everybody feared and in fact it's pretty darn good. If you look at the board for last week, December live cattle into the week at 117.12 up just 20 cents for the week. November feeder cattle ended the week at 155 even, down 75 cents. The October uh, spot live cattle contract ended the week at 112.82, still a little bit of a negative basis there, but uh, we had an impressive fat cattle trade last week. Might not have got the dollar 12 that everybody really had for a goal, but we had good clearance of the show list uh, through Thursday, mind you, 85,500 head and over 83,000 of those were on Thursday, but we had more trade on Friday, had some cleanup trade on Friday. We had a, a, a 50 cent gain up in the northwest part of the five area feeding region in western Nebraska, Wyoming, and Colorado areas that hadn't traded a lot of cattle through Thursday. On Friday, they got an extra 50 cents, so they traded a lot of their cattle at 111.50, but the bulk of the rest of the cattle was $2 higher at 111. Our weighted average is gonna be over 111. Uh, your dress trade was one to $3 higher at 175. Slaughter was a little bit disappointing in that they, they slowed it down late in the week with some cleanup uh, and some plants and then kind of a slow Saturday. But 622,000 head uh, were slaughtered and that was down 10,000 from the previous week, up 21,000 from the same week a year ago. Box beef cutout values on the average of the week's trade, steady to firm, so that's holding pretty well. Your feeder cattle markets, real-time index ended the week at 154.38. That was up 62 cents from the previous week. And uh, it's not as high as the trend was, but a lot more seven to 899 pound full-fledged calves were in that. And that did pull it down a little bit, but still uh, showed a gain with all those big calves moving up in the Northern Plains. But uh, your feeder cattle ended the week three to five dollars higher uh, for, for true feeders and calves, sure, three to five dollars higher too. But good demand for everything. Late in the week, an individual quote, Lexington, Nebraska at 345 on Friday afternoon, sold 108 head of big steer calves weighing 756. They bring 170.50. That's your feeder flash for Monday.